Welcome back to Video for the Day. This is Sankarshan Das speaking to you from ISKCON, Austin, Texas, USA. Where does everything come from? Dr. Stephen Hawking says it all comes from nothing. One gentleman I've been writing with on the internet, he says it comes from hydrogen. So where does everything actually come from? Well, Krishna very clearly states in the Gita, Aham sarvasya prabhava matak sarvam pervartate iti madva bhajante bang buddha bhava saman vataha. I am the source of all material and spiritual worlds. Everything emanates from me. The wise who know this perfectly engage in my devotional service and worship me with all their hearts. If you think about it, it's much more logical that everything comes from a person. Everything coming out of nothing is not logical because we don't see any practical example of things coming out of nothing. That something can operate in a very systematic, organized way without an operator also is not within our experience. So the idea of a supreme operator is very logical and scientific. So we should understand that Krishna is actually the source of all existence. Everything we experience, indeed our very selves, are his emanated energy. Tune into this reality, vibrate with this reality, and you'll be in ecstatic mood in all times, places, and circumstances. Just try it. Just try to see everything is the energy of Krishna and therefore everything is meant to be used in the service of Krishna. If you just embrace this paradigm, this vision of reality, and put it into practice, you'll be such a happy, fulfilled, peaceful person. So just try it. You'll love it. This is our invitation to the whole world. We want the whole world to now become Krishna conscious. This is our desire. Let everyone become happy by understanding that I am the eternal servant of Krishna. Thank you for tuning in. Hare Krishna. Mm-hmm.